It is 16 minutes past seven o'clock. Well, one year on from Australia's worst bushfire disaster, Victoria has paused to remember those who died. Our Nola Hafner spent the day with Black Saturday survivors. Nola, wow, what was the overwhelming feeling among everybody? Morning, Mel. Look, I think survivors are all coping in their own ways. I mean, some were still clearly very traumatised. Others are firmly focused on the future. I mean, the anniversary was the opportunity to remember the victims, grieve for their losses, and people did this in different ways. We'd all see a minute's silence. Then a game of 2020 cricket to remember lost mates. We're a bit worried in the beginning about doing it, thinking that maybe we shouldn't be doing it. It should be a day of remembrance, but as you can see by the crowd that's here, it, uh, obviously everyone's backed it and supported our event and, and thought it was a good idea. 173 people died on Black Saturday. Here, they lay a flower for each of them. In King Lake, Whittlesea, this is just one area. Um, services like that, uh, community gatherings like that happened right across the bushfire affected regions. West Gippsland, uh, Beechworth, Marysville, Bendigo. And I think that was what was so touching about the day, Mel, is that it was each community deciding for themselves how they wanted to mark this day. And as Jane O'Connor said, now that this big hurdle is over, perhaps today will feel like a, a new year. Mm. Well, we wish them all the very best for that new year. Nola, thank Thank you for that report. Appreciate your time.